Health and safety signs play a very important role in every construction site. Health and safety messages are delivered through safety signs on every construction site. This is not only required to comply with construction regulations, but also to make sure that every site staff is well taken care of and the project site aims to maintain zero accident records throughout the duration of construction. What are those health and safety signs? It is very important for site staff to understand the meaning of each and every health and safety sign. Every sign carries an important message, they are not placed for the sake of formalities. If a site staff fails to recognize a sign, it could lead to a serious disaster on site. All health and safety signs are supposed to comply with the health and safety regulations of that country. Site staff are trained to understand those signs thoroughly and they must possess the required qualification to work on site. Type of health and safety signs. There are five key types of health and safety signs used on construction sites. Warning signs. Mandatory signs. Prohibition signs. Safe condition signs. Fire equipment signs. Warning signs. Warning signs are provided to alert site staff and members of the public regarding the possible threats and minimize the risk of an accident. The shapes of warning signs are generally triangular and come with a yellow color plate. Following are the few examples where warning signs are provided. Presence of asbestos on site. When a high voltage overhead cable network is passing above the construction zone. Presence of highly inflammable gases within the construction zone. Presence of harmful chemicals. Wet floor. Mandatory signs. Mandatory signs are placed to convey the information that is a compulsory requirement. Mandatory signs inform site staff as well as the normal public to follow mandatory instructions to stay safe within the site compound and associated areas. Mandatory signs come with a blue color circular shape and on top of that white color pictorial symbols are placed to convey the mandatory messages. A combination of contrast color blue and white assist all users to see the information clearly. For example, where appropriate peep or keep fire exit clear from obstruction, etc. Following are the few examples where mandatory signs are placed. A hard hat should be worn all time on site. High vis peep should be worn all time on site. Wear glasses, gloves and ear protector. A safety harness should be worn. Prohibition signs. Prohibition signs are provided to clearly inform what actions are forbidden and who is forbidden. Prohibition signs are shown in a circular panel with black symbols. Prohibition sign informs users that what action must be avoided such as no smoking, or no entry. The color of the prohibition sign is printed in a red circle with a cross line passing over the black symbol. Following are the few examples where prohibition signs are placed. No entry to a particular section or site. Speed limit sign within the site compound and or parking zone. No smoking signs. No parking signs if parking is not provided within the site compound. Safe Condition Signs Safe Condition Signs provide the information of the location of a safe place, location of safe evacuation route, location of safety kit or first aid kit, etc. These signs play a very important role in case of any emergency, that's why it's essential to place them in the right and clearly visible locations. Safe Condition Signs normally come in a green color square panel where text and symbols are written in white color. Following are the few examples where safe condition signs are placed. Fire exit. Fire assembly meeting point. Push bar to open the gate. Safety kit or first aid kit location. Aid. First aid box. Emergency shower. Fire equipment signs. Fire equipment signs provide the information and direction to fire equipment's location. Fire equipment signs come with a red color rectangular panel with text and symbols in white color. Following are the few examples where fire equipment signs are placed. Fire hydrant sign. Fire extinguisher sign. Fire alarm sign. Fire blanket sign. How safety signs are categorized with color of the sign panels. Red color circular panel. The red color panel simply represents prohibition, which means an activity that must stop. Yellow color panel. The yellow color panel is used to warn the users regarding a possible danger or threat. Blue color panel. Blue color panel is provided to inform the user of certain mandatory activities, for example, wearing peep or hard hats, etc. Green color panel. 
Green color panel is provided to inform users regarding the safe conditions such as safe evacuation route or first aid kit location, etc. Red color rectangular panel. Red color rectangular panel is used to inform users about fire equipment location. Whether a site staff or a member of the public, it is very important for them to know the meaning and details of these signs to safely perform their duties adequately. Please feel free to like, comment, and share it.